Good morning and welcome back to uh, my another pickup video. Uh, this is for July. Uh, so let's get started with the CDs. Uh, first things first, uh, picked up copy of Dr. Dre, The Chronic. Uh, Priestess. Jerky Boys. Wish this thing would stay focused. Uh, Bare Naked Ladies. Uh, Ozzy Osbourne Live at Budokan. This is a good one here. Uh, Queen Greatest Hits 1, 2, and 3. Uh, Tree. Not really sure. Uh, they are metal. They're, they're decent, I guess. Uh, Our Lady Peace. Uh, another comedy, uh, Chris Rock. Uh, some British punk uh, called Orange, or Welcome to the something of Orange, World of Orange. Uh, Veronica's see, Divas Live '99. Piano collections of Final Fantasy VIII. Well, it's the basically the piano, uh, the soundtrack for Final Fantasy VIII, uh, done on piano, I guess. And this uh, Sex America Cheap Trick. I uh, got this with a 50% off coupon at Fye. Really great store for music. Uh, great collection here. And uh, that'll do it for the music for July. Get it put safely out of the way. And we can move on to the movies. Uh, The Tale of Despero. Uh, it's a story about a mouse that doesn't want to be scared like a mouse. Pick this one up at the thrift store. Uh, over 13 hours of giant monster movies. <coughs> Nine movies on three DVDs. I don't know if you can read that or not, but uh, there's the track listings. Uh, it's only movies for this month. Uh, I did pick up uh, some pins at a yard sale for uh, World War Z. Right, those are my pin collection. Let's see, what else did we got here? I don't know if you can see that. Uh, let's see. Magic with cards. You know, magic card trick set. Thought my kids would like that. Photography Q&A by Zacharias. A couple uh, RPG books. Got uh, Dragonlance Atlas. Uh, basically, all the maps for the world of Dragonlance. And the art of Dragonlance. Uh, I got these two books from my buddy Nick that's in the uh, guitar videos. He bought a huge lot of uh, Dungeons & Dragon books. And uh, I helped him go pick them up and everything. So he uh, let me have those. Uh, let's see. On to... I got some, uh, some retro things. Some retro tech. Uh... We got here is a uh, old school Panasonic uh, cassette recorder. Uh, it does work. Picked that up for two bucks at a estate sale along with a uh, factory sealed cassette. Uh, I love old tech like this. That's also why I picked up this Nokia 
bag phone. This is what a cell phone used to be. Uh, I'm going to do some experience on it with it. It does work. I'm going to try to see if I can get it hooked up to the modern cell networks. And if I can, I will let you guys know about it. If I can't, this is the last you'll ever hear about it. Okay. I also got a vintage VHS camcorder. Things big and bulky. I'm not digging it out. Uh, picked up. Uh, it's hard to get this all in one frame. I need to move my camera back. But uh, picked up two of these at a yard sale for a dollar. They're, uh, I don't know, see them on the infomercials. It uses light to paint on like a glow-in-the-dark uh, screen. Like I said, I got two of them. I also got... Uh, A mini uh, light bright. Oops, have to get those cleaned up. But put one peg in here if I can. You put those little pegs in there, they glow. And this thing auto shuts off after a while. Okay. Now I'll have to pan around with this one. It is. Operation. There we go. Operation. Uh, fun board game. Uh, got it for like a bucket of yard sale. It was missing one piece. The butterfly found it online for like two bucks. Now it's complete. Good to go. I also picked up. Another board game. I don't know anything about this one. I haven't even looked to see if it's complete yet. It's called uh, Lionheart. Looks like it's a figure and uh, like it's got 92 sculpted warriors and like battle pieces and stuff like that in it. So I figured it'd be pretty cool. Okay. On to the gaming stuff. I don't know what this is exactly. It looked like a uh, uh, Game Boy Advanced case, but then it has these little sleeves, so I have no idea. Mini discs, maybe, for a mini disc player, which I do have one. That would be interesting, so maybe that's not gaming stuff, but whatever. Okay, picked up a new Kinect and a power supply for the Kinect. So I can hook it to my PC. Uh, I'm going to be doing a few experiments with that and the infrared lights. Uh, picked up some V-Smile things for my kids. I have no idea what learning content. Uh, Blue's Clues. More learning content. Learning content. And learning content. Now I just have to get a working V-Smile because the two that I bought recently were super corroded battery compartments and unsure if they work. Uh, picked up a couple uh, DS manuals. Uh, I don't have the, well I have Clubhouse games but I don't have the other one. But, uh, I also picked up a, I traded for this, I traded a cup like two game, Sega game gears that apparently at least one of them didn't work but I traded them for this because uh, I've been wanting one with the Game Boy Advance slot in the front because I have a couple uh, DS games that require that and I've been wanting to play them so it, it works has a cracked hinge but that's no big deal oh, there's some of those light bright pegs falling all over uh, I also picked up a Game Genie on my finger piece of tape uh, and it also came with uh, volume 2 code book I forget which one number that is but another version of the code book and then another one 
uh, three different versions of the code book. So that was pretty cool. Got that from uh, Gold and Silver Pawn Shop on Union, my buddy's pawn shop. Uh, let's see, and lastly, uh, this was part of a trade for that uh, Virtual Boy controller I had. I got uh, this Final Fantasy for the PC, and that uh, Final Fantasy music CD, the piano one. Uh, traded. Th I got those two things, and he got Virtual Boy controller and... Oh, one of us the spare virtual boy game I had I forget what title it was but uh, yeah well that's everything I got for the month of July so stay tuned for more videos uh, and I'll catch you later have a good day see ya